dreamer You had so little in your life it seemed But you never lost the power to dream I dream of rainbows lighting up the sky I dream of children finding wings to fly When someone like you dreams of me One thing I can do Let me live this dream For you My dear friends, today we celebrate the feast of St. John Bosco. From early childhood, our Lord Jesus and Our Lady repeatedly inspired John a poor peasant boy in northern Italy. After his ordination in the city of Turin, he set out deliberately to cultivate every means for gaining the confidence and friendship of the angsters. This he would begin and end with a simple catechism instruction, the recitation of the rosary or an explanation of the morning sermon. As St. John's work became better known and supported by cooperators, he was able to establish regular night schools and put everything on a permanent basis by founding his Salatian Institute in Turin under the protection of Our Lady, Help of Christians and St. Francis de Sales. Through them, his boys learned their religion, reading, writing, and a trade under a remarkable educational system based upon frequent confession and daily mass. St. John Bosco could read the hearts of his students and they in turn knew him to be a saint. His unique influence can be illustrated when 300 convicts from the city jail were permitted to go with him on a day's outing, unaccompanied by any guards. In order to extend his beneficent work also to young girls, the saint founded the Daughters of Our Lady, Help of Christians in 1872. The Salesians grew rapidly. St. John Bosco died on January 31, 1888 and was canonized in 1934. Today, as we celebrate his feast, let us remember his words. Do the best you can. God and Our Lady will do the rest. Glorious St. John Bosco, who in order to lead young people to the feet of the Divine Master and to mold them in the light of faith and Christian morality, did heroically sacrifice yourself to the very end of your life and set up a proper religious institute destined to ensure and to bring to the farthest boundaries of the earth your glorious work. Obtain also for us from our Lord a holy love for young people who are exposed to so many seductions in order that we may generously spend ourselves in supporting them against the snares of the devil in keeping them safe from the dangers of the world and in guiding them pure and holy in the path that leads to God. Amen.